Good evening, everybody, and um, uh, welcome to the Sundays with Susie concert, uh, the first of three. And maybe this will go on a while. We'll see. Hello to all you out there, and um, hope that you are holding up um, amidst all of this and that you are well. Um, uh, me and mine are fine, and hope same by you. Um, um, so uh, uh, I'm really humbled at the response of everybody coming in uh, to join us here and the excitement of, uh, of um, everything uh, with this. And uh, um, I'm going to play some songs that I've written. And uh, many of you uh, have pitched in requests via email and, uh, and, um, and on Facebook. and. Uh, I'm going to get to some of those. So uh, I'll be playing about 45 minutes, and I hope you enjoy yourself plenty. Here's a song from, here's a song from The Gospel Truth. And some would say, the time has passed me by. Some would say, that the wells have all run dry some would say that's how it has to be so some would say but i beg to disagree because i know good fortune waits for me somewhere I will have my portion, I will have my share. I'll keep my feet in motion until they carry me there. I will have my portion, I will have my share. Because I do believe there's a harvest in the field, I do believe, I do believe. That's your part. There's truth to be revealed, I do believe, I do believe. There's treasure to be found, and I do believe. There's enough to go around. I know good fortune, sing along. I know good fortune waits for me, waits for me somewhere. I will have my portion. I will have my portion. I will my share. I'll keep my feet in motion till they carry me there. I will have my portion. I will have my share. Cause somewhere there's a blessing that will bear my name. And soon or late it's coming to me just the same. I can't wait to see was set aside for me with every new sun arise I'm gonna keep my eyes wide open cause I know I know I know I know good fortune waits for me somewhere I will have my portion I will have my portion I will have my share I'll keep my feet in Till the care me there I will have my portion I will have my share I will have my portion I will have my share Yes, I will, yes, I will I will have my portion requested by Bonnie Golden. You requested that. Thanks, everybody, for joining us uh, as part of uh, Susan Warner song request evening, Susie's with Sunday. Um, here's another one that was requested. This one was requested by my mama. Oh, Tom. Tom Gannon. Hi, Tom Gannon. You just came to the show in Austin. That was really nice of you and your wife to come over. I hope you had a good getaway. Um, and Mary. Anderson in Arlington, Texas. I love Texas. That was so fun to be there with all of you recently. 
I had such a nice day down there. I love some Texas. I love me some Texas. Do we say that? I don't really say that. Here's a song for all of you on the West Coast. We're holding you in our hearts right now. Yes, we are. I certainly am. Seattle, take care. Oregon, take care. Northern California, take care. <laughs> Sonoma County on a Sunday, not a cloud in the California sky. See my Buddha in the backyard, unperturbed as the ants crawl up his thigh. TJ sitting in a deck chair, smiles her easy smile from ear to ear. Maura standing in the doorway says you really ought to move out here. Petaluma afternoons when the light comes pouring in. The buttered sunshine on your skin is full of love and vitamins and they always end too soon. These Petaluma afternoons your book up on the table stretch yourself out underneath the sun close your eyes and let the day of dreams dance across your forehead one by one troubles fade into the distance with the grateful dead still on the radio Laura reads the weather for you, says New York City got another three feet of snow. Holding you in our hearts, New York City. Petaluma afternoons, when the light comes pouring in. The buttered sunshine on your skin is full of love and vitamins. And they always end too soon. It's Petaluma afternoons. Feel the healing golden rays. Feel them warm your frozen bones. The mm sun -hmm. as the music plays. And the serotonin flows in. La 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 la. Song was written in like 1998 when sort of pharma psychopharmaceuticals were just coming into vogue. La 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 serotonin. La la la. La la la. La la la. Goodbye kisses round sundown. There's gas and coffee by the interstate. Interstate five. You're due in Vancouver in the morning. Safe to say you're gonna be a little late. You are. But Portland's nothing but a downspout. Seattle is only still boats in the rain. Oh, I'm really sorry, it's just the song. So drag your feet to California. God knows you've got nothing to explain. Sending love to all of you. I saw my last trip there in Berkeley and Sacramento. Petaluma afternoons when the light comes pouring in. The buttered sunshine on your skin is full of love and vitamins, and they always end too soon. Northern California, hello to all our friends in Marin County. Is it the Marin in the, in the Marin, Marin? And Sonoma County in the Marin. I live in the Marin. I live across the bridge. Love to all of you across the miles. As um, uh, as a uh, um, uh, Peg Runnels said today, she said, "Music is the shortest distance between two people." I love that, and um, she's hoping that we're closing the distance a little bit tonight together. And um, I'm thinking of all of you from here in Philadelphia, where the streets are 
pretty quiet and the sidewalks are pretty quiet and it is an odd moment an odd moment here too um so uh, i had uh, many requests for this next song so many uh olga walrus requested this song along with many of you and uh i think um to do this song i should really do one of these here just to add to it this is a song uh, that was written after seeing a friend I hadn't seen in a while. And, um, oh my, uh, she had gone through a few changes. And um, let's take care of this right. This right here. That'll do it. That'll get rid of my 11s. Right. <laughs> Well, hello, my old friend. How very wonderful to see you again. And I'm sure this probably isn't quite the time or the place, but what did you do to your face? I mean, what with the eyes? You look like everything's a total surprise, like a hyper little hunting dog about to give chase. What did you do to your face? Because your nose is so small now, so teeny tiny, how do you breathe it all? And your lips balloons, overinflated as a pair of pontoons. You look weird, you look good. You don't look anything like anyone should, except for people from Los Angeles and deep outer space. What did you do to your face? And you've smoothed your brow. You got it flatter than Nevada somehow. And your chin's tucked in. So tight your boobs go up whenever you grin. Hey, you're right. I'm a jerk. If you don't mind my asking who did the work, do you think there's any chance that they'd consider my case? What did you do to your face? Was it expensive? What did you do to your face? And was it painful? What did you do to your face? Would you go with me? <laughs> what did you do to your face? <sighs> Crowd goes wild for these uh, these little things called smoothies. Yes, you can get them on the Amazon, and uh, like we're doing everything now, getting it on Amazon. And um, yeah, you just stick them on here, and they get rid of your 11s. And also, uh, um, hi, Bob. My brother Bob taught me they're called 11s. And then you can put them here also to get rid of um, puppet, fa uh, puppet mouth, I think they call it. So these are, you know, just something different to try. And um, so just, you know, something to bear in mind. I mean, if you have a little time at home, Wear them around the house. Um, so uh, there have been many requests for this next song. And again, thank you all for joining um, joining the show. Uh, many requests for this next song. Um, let's see. Bob Nor Nolte, Bob Nolte, our friend Bob Nolte, uh, Jim Nixon, Claudia Blake, and uh, Chris Warner. Should I take this off? I should probably take this off. Feel it. Um, have requested this song. Well, I come from the rural Midwest. It's the land I love more than all the rest. It's the place I know and understand. Like a false front building, like the back of my hand. And the men I knew when I was coming up were sober as coffee in a styrofoam cup. There were Earls and Rays, Harlans and Roys. They were full grown men. They were barbed wire boys. They raised 
raised grain and cattle on the treeless fields sat at the head of the table and prayed before meals prayed our father that was enough you pray more than that you couldn't stay tough tough as the busted thumbnails on their weathered hands they worked the gold plate off their wedding bands and they never complained no they never made noise and they never left home these barbed wire boys cause they're Dreams were all fenced in by the weight of family, by the feeling of sin that'll prick your skin at the slightest touch if you reach too far, if you feel too much. So their deepest hopes never were expressed. Just beating like bird's wings in the cage of their chest All the restless longings, all the secret joys That never were set free In the barbed wire boys Now, one by one, they're departing this earth. And it's clear to me now exactly what they're worth. Well, they were just like Atlas holding up the sky. You never heard him speak. You never saw him cry. But where do the tears go? That you never shed where do the words go that you never said well there's a blink of the eye there's a catch in the voice that is the unsung song of the barbed wire boy I hope that song reminds you of some people that you know. It certainly reminds me of some people I know and love. Um, uh, this next song, O is old, old song, old song, but many requests for this song. John Kuby, Don Buck in New Hampshire requested this one. And I forgot, I totally forgot about this song. So this is from Live at Ten Angel. Um, Live at Ten Angel recorded in 1992 in a little club called The Tin Angel in Philadelphia. And here's a shout out to all of you who uh, frequented that club uh, on, um, on 2nd Street, uh, just South Market. And uh, how wild that, like I'm back here in Philadelphia all this time later, whoa, whoa. Life does things, doesn't it? Yes, life does things. All right, I have to look up the lyrics and show you this one. 
Oh, there it is. There it is. Thank you for staying with us. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, just an update. Um, so I'll be doing this uh, every Sunday until this thing's over. Whatever this thing is, I'll be here every Sunday at 7 until this thing is over. And um, and we can kind of resume playing shows um, with you and for you uh, in person. Um, next Sunday will be all new songs uh, that I'm working on for the new record. And uh, you will get a chance to weigh in on those. And I welcome your feedback um, because other people hearing them is what tells me if they're, you know, is there something there or is it just me being a, you know, a smart ass? So, um, so please join us next Sunday at 7. Give your patience. Here we go. Hell or high water. Here we go. Well, I'm standing at the jukebox in this little corner bar where the playlist is all country stars. On a good day, I'd give my last quarter and smile just to hear George Strait singing away. But the song in my head is as loud as a plane and as long as a train pulling grain. And it follows me around like a three-legged hound getting by on two legs and a sprain. Ain't I strong? Ain't I stunning? Ain't I stable now? Ain't I smart? Ain't I stuck with a big empty heart? Ain't I brave? Ain't I beautiful? Ain't I better now? Ain't I bright? Jesus Christ, ain't I lonely tonight? A good song for social distancing. Ah! Patsy Klein singing crazy, and I was the time or two. Who'd believe everything I've been through? But now I'm sane, now I'm simpler, now I'm standing here on my own. Now I'm spending the night all alone. Ain't I strong? Ain't I stunning? Ain't I stable now? Ain't I smart? Ain't I stuck with a big empty heart? Ain't I brave? Ain't I beautiful? Ain't I better now? Ain't I bright? Jesus Christ, ain't I lonely tonight? This song comes from a period where we were all doing affirmations, right? Like, what was his name on Saturday Night Live? Stuart, what was his name? And he would say, gosh, I'm wonderful. Gosh, aren't I wonderful? I'm so intelligent. Yeah, all right. Here's the affirmations, right? That's what this is. Well, I on the bathroom mirror. I wrote it in riddles in my diary. I said it before I fell asleep at night. But I love you don't mean that much to me. No, I love you don't mean that much to me from me. Well, my mind's got a jukebox with a mind of its own. And tonight it won't leave me alone. So I settle my bill and leave two dollars more on the bar as I head towards the door. It's then that I notice the man across the way. His eyes read like headlines that say, Ain't I strong? Ain't I gentle? Ain't I married now? Ain't I right for you? And Jesus Christ, ain't I lonely tonight? Ain't I strong? Ain't I stunning? Ain't I stable now? Ain't I smart? Ain't I strong? Ain't I stunning? Ain't I stable now? Ain't I smart? Ain't I stuck with a big empty heart? Brave, beautiful, better. Ain't I brave? Ain't I beautiful? Ain't I better now? Ain't I bright? Jesus Christ, ain't I lonely tonight? Jesus Christ, ain't I lonely tonight?
1992, that's Susan Werner with Ain't I Lonely Tonight. That was at least number 548 on the Billboard Hot 10,488. Uh, the next song. Oh, many requests for this next song. And um, again, hope that you are enjoying the show from the comfort. Well, we're all, aren't we all kind of enjoying the show from the comfort of someplace comfortable? Yeah, that's sort of, yeah. Here we are amidst all of it. And uh, as I said at the top of the show, and I'll only play until 7.45 Eastern. Then it's over. That's it. It's over. There's no more. No more. That's it. It's the end. And if you want to join us next Sunday, then you can join us next Sunday at 7 and the next Sunday at 7 and the next Sunday at 7 Eastern Time. Eastern Daylight Time. Oh, may I share with you? I want to share with you something kind of wonderful that happened recently. Um, I finally got the guitar of my dreams. Which happened in uh, December. I got, look, um, I got a Collings, Collings, made in Austin, Texas, and it is a wonderful guitar. It has the most lovely, lovely sound. I'm going to play this on guitar because my piano has a broken key in the middle. I should have it fixed by next week. May I suggest, may I suggest to you, may I suggest this is the best part of your life. May I suggest this time is blessed for you. This time is blessed and shining almost blinding bright. Just turn your head and you'll begin to see the thousand reasons that were just beyond your sight. The reasons why, why I'd suggest to you, why I'd suggest this is the best part of There is a world that's been addressed to you, addressed to you, intended only for your eyes. It's a secret world like a treasure chest to you, with private scenes and brilliant dreams that mesmerize. A tender lover's smile. Tiny baby's hands, the million stars that fill the turning sky at night. And I suggest, yes, I suggest to you, yes, I suggest this is the best part of your life. It's been expressed in you. It's the hope of seven generations, maybe more. And this is the faith that they invest in you. It's that you'll do one better than was done before. And inside you know, inside you understand. Inside you know what's yours to finally set right. And I suggest, I suggest to you, I suggest this is the best part of your life. This is a song. Comes from the west to you, 
Comes from the west, comes from the slowly setting sun. This is a song with a request of you to see how very short these endless days will run. And when they're gone, and when the dark descends, oh, we'd give anything for one more hour of light. And I suggest this is the best part. Your life. Well, as I usually say, I hope this is a good moment in your life for reasons maybe you forgot until just now. And I mean, maybe there's grateful for all the love in my life. I feel really grateful right now. I'm lucky. Lucky. Very fortunate. And you kind of know now who matters, right? That still kind of floats up, doesn't it? Who's tuning in with you right now? I don't mean tuning in with Facebook Live. I don't mean that. I mean, you know, who's checking on you? Who's seeing how you're feeling? Here's a song for the Bagby family from Nebraska. I love you so much and say hello to your folks for me. Uh, this one comes from a record called Hayseed, songs about farms, farmers, and the people who love them. And uh, this is um, my father's favorite song, I think. Hi, Dad, are you watching? <laughs> should understand this before he walked me down the aisle you can have the money from the oats the money from the cow the money from the goats and the money from the sow but don't you ever touch the egg money that's crossing the line don't you ever touch the egg money the egg money is mine. We had seven good years. Then the trouble all began. First he started nipping at the gym. Then he started seeing Mary Ann. Then he started gambling dice, lost the horses and the plow. I felt behind the stove, there was nothing there now. He had taken all the egg money. That's crossing the line. That's crossing the line. Don't you ever touch the egg money. The egg money is mine. left in 1922 so the angel that I am poured the coffee in his cup served his toast with butter and jam and the eggs were sunny side up and the eggs were maybe too old and the eggs had maybe gone bad three days and the body went cold doctor said it's terribly sad Sing it, girls. 
Don't you ever touch the egg money. That's crossing the line. That's crossing the line. Don't you ever touch the egg money. The egg money is mine. Don't you ever touch the... Let me hear you. That's crossing the line. Don't you ever touch the egg money. The egg money is mine. Yes. Yeah. Egg money. Oh, I'm going to say hello to some people here. That's cross on the line. Da, 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 da. Roxanne Peterson says Nebraska. Oh, Nebraska. I have a song for you on the next project. I love Nebraska. Um, okay, this song. Uh, hello. Oh, Marissa. Hello. Nebraska and Hayseed. Hey, you played a role in that. Marissa Gil Kaiser, and you know it. Hayseed, sponsored by the University of Nebraska. Institute for Agriculture and Natural Resources and the LEAD Center in Lincoln, Nebraska. And we appreciate their support. Appreciate you tuning in. Um, all of you who have joined us this evening, join me, joined us. Hi to Kelly Lynn Knott, my digital coordinator, who is running the some of the commentary going on. And, um, uh, and, um, and my manager, Patty uh, Romanoff, who I know has helped coordinate this. Um, uh, from behind the scenes, thank you so much, Patty, and my tour manager, the great Jane Paul, who I know is watching and probably commenting with smart remarks even. As we proceed on to a song, there'll be two more songs. That's it. Not three. Not four. Not five. Two. So you brought along your girlfriend your kind of pretty crazy girlfriend. What the hell were you thinking? She never stops drinking. She talks all the time. And now you're running out of money. Yeah, you've been running through the money. You don't know where it all went right now. You just spent your very last dime. Yeah, yeah. When you're in a 1955 Chevy Bel Air and you're cruising the Malacca. Oh, all your troubles are gone. Uh, when you're in a 1955 Chevy Bel Air and you're cruising La Ventitres, yeah. Oh, world's a wonderful place. Sending this song out to Terry Gill, who came with me to Havana. Round Soul came with me to Havana. It was wonderful. What a wonderful trip. Here's to one we can get back to going places together. Ah, and you're driving with the top down. You're in the sunshine with the top down. Yeah, you're rolling in a carriage that is the perfect marriage of vinyl and chrome. You've got the white walls and the tail fins, the two-tone color and the tail fins. Salsa on the AM station. Why in this vacation? Why ever go home? When you're in the 1955 Chevy Bel Air and you're cruising the Malacan, oh, all your troubles are gone. Oh, when you're in the 1955 Chevy Bel Air and you're cruising La Ventitres, yeah, oh, it's a wonderful place. As you go past La Zora y El Cuervo, you'll smile and let every last care go, floating away on the music in your ears. As you go past La Media Coiba, your girlfriend gets out and says, see ya. Yeah, she's over it, she's had enough. You don't care because now you're in love. Oh, with a Chevrolet. Hey. When you're in a 1955 Chevy Bel Air, sing it. When you're in a 1955 Chevy Bel Air and you're cruising the Malacan, all your troubles are gone. Oh, all your troubles are gone. When you're in a 1955 Chevy Bel Air and you're cruising the Venti Trace, yeah. Oh, world's a wonderful place. When you're in a 1955 Chevy Bel Air, oh, la 
la la la la. And when you're with a 1955 Chevy Bel Air, oh, 1955 Chevy Bel Air from Susan Warner's An America, An American in Havana, recording. Who am I, Casey Kasem? Casey Kasem and the top. So what was it? What was what's what's called? Ugh, America's top forty. Casey Kasem. I'm Casey Kasem. Uh, and we'll close tonight's show with the number one song. It's not the number one song, but uh, there was a request for this song, uh, and I will honor it. An early song. This request came from Manchester, Iowa, and uh, that's important. Uh, Manchester, Iowa holds more influence over some of my decision making uh, than, you know, Toledo. Uh, which, you know, I've, I've been to Toledo. Um, I like Toledo. You have a great AAA ballpark there. Um, but, um, no. Well, I'll close with this song, which was a request um, by many people, uh, but especially, um, yes, someone out there in Manchester. So we will send this one out to Manchester. And um, thanks again for joining uh, the concert, and um, I hope this has been of some comfort and company to you. Um, and it really has been humbling to see um, some of you uh, sharing uh, the link for this uh, with your friends. And uh, thank you for spending part of your Sunday here. And uh, again, I hope that um, we can keep each other company through some of this. Uh, and may it end soon. Um, uh... <laughs> And it's clear and a full moon tonight. Let's go down to my mother's garden. I'll tap on your door at a quarter to one. Come quickly as soon as you hear me. And we'll steal down the carpet and stairs. Put pajamas in pajamas of packers and bears. And we'll hold in our breath till we're out the back door with food for the dog so he's quiet. We'll slip across the grass in our tender bare feet with the blades clinging on to our ankles. And the crickets will sing us the Latin high mass as we come to the altar of flowers. And the snapdragon's narrow tall. And the zinnias, the brightest of all. And the peonies came from great-grandmother's farm And someday I'll grow them at my house Come over a row to the peas and the beans All waiting like good little soldiers Go on, help yourself to a handful of each. The best ones are always the young ones. And the ground cherries grow down the line. Eat a dozen or so off the vine. And then what happens? Oh, and the muskmelon's ripe. We'll crack one and two, and we'll feast just like thieves up in heaven. That was it, that was it. Uh -huh. 
Then we'll sneak back inside like the Native Americans would. Some of them. Most of the Iroquois, which are probably not actually from Iowa. Sorry. Being sure not to step on the branches. And we'll slip into bed and we'll lie wide awake till the moon sinks below California. And my mother, she sleeps and she knows. One eye open, the other eye closed. In the morning, she'll smile and she'll wave us goodbye. And she'll never betray our adventure. It's warm and it's clear and a full moon tonight. Let's go down to my mother's garden. Thanks everybody. I hope you have someplace wonderful to go um, in your imagination and your hearts. Um, we'll see you um, next week, a week from now, uh, seven o'clock next Sunday, Eastern time. And we'll keep doing this until we don't have to do it anymore. Um, I hope that's soon. Um, meanwhile, same bat time, same bat channel. Um, see you next week. All the best. Take good care. Be safe. Thanks. Bye.